Hello everyone, Adrian here. Today I am going to bring you along while I make Walton Pie, also known as Lord Walton Pie. This is a dish from the World War II era in Great Britain. Um, it was a time when there was very severe rationing and so uh, the government actually provided recipes for people to use uh, things that are available. And in this case, this is um, an accidentally vegan recipe. Um, meat, butter, uh, sugar, fats, a whole bunch of other things were pretty severely rationed uh, at different times uh, in escalating ways. And um, so what was never rationed and was always available was fresh fruits and vegetables, um, things that were not imported, that is, things that could be grown in Britain. So um, this particular pie is made out of uh, root vegetables and uh, potatoes, along with some other things. Um, also, it was hard to, to get uh, white flour, so there's um, wholemeal flour and then the dough is actually partly made with mashed potatoes. So that's kind of an interesting thing too. It makes your flour stretch a little bit longer. So we're going to start with um, the filling and you actually cook that first. So we've got a pound of carrots, a pound of cauliflower, a pound of uh, parsnips, and a pound of potatoes, along with three green onions, some vegetable extract, and I'm going to use Marmite. And um, that's something that we're going to boil together, uh, simmer together anyway, uh, we'll just cover it with just enough water and simmer it down. Um, and that becomes the gravy inside. Um, then we combine it with our crust. And um, I'll show you those steps later. But let's start with our filling. So I forgot to mention that in addition to the vegetables and the marmite there, we have a tablespoon of oatmeal, which is going to thicken it up just a little bit here. The marmite in this case acts like a bouillon. There's a savory, slightly salty, kind of umami flavor that marmite brings to dishes like this. While our vegetables are simmering away uh, until everything is soft, we are going to make our crust. So I've got eight ounces of um, wholemeal flour, whole wheat flour in this case, a half a teaspoon of salt, and two teaspoons of baking powder. Um, to that, I'm going to add um, three ounces of um, uh, vegan butter, margarine, and um, then once we combine that with just a little bit of water, try to work this into a dough, and then we're also going to combine that with four ounces of mashed potatoes that I cooked earlier. So some of the people who were making this online were complaining about this dough. Um, and actually, I don't, I don't think this is too bad. I mean, I haven't rolled it out yet, but uh, it came together pretty nicely. Um, I added some cold water, maybe um, maybe a quarter of a cup, uh, about that, and then added the mashed potatoes and um, kneaded it just a little bit, and it all kind of came together nicely. Okay, so my vegetables are softened up. Um, there's a little bit more water or broth in there than I was expecting. And if I do this again, I'll probably put in a little less water when I'm doing this. But uh, uh, that's, you know, going to be the gravy inside the pie. Uh, so I will probably use most of it, uh, if not all of it, once I put it into the baking dish here. Um, I'm also a little bit concerned. I'm not sure if all of that's going to fit inside, but we'll see. <laughs> 
As I suspected, this is actually more filling than this dish is going to hold. So uh, I mean, they're going to have that as a nice vegetable stew later, or uh, I don't think I've got enough crust for another pie, but uh, well, I'll figure it out. So, but in any case, I'm going to have a nice, uh, a nice pie in this um, nine by nine baking dish. And now I'm going to put the crust on top. Okay, so here is my crust on top of the filling. Uh, give a little vent hole. Um, tried to do a little bit, <laughs> uh, not very pretty decorative uh, edging with a spoon, uh, but here we go. So we put it in uh, at a 400 degree oven for 25 to 30 minutes until it gets browned on the top. Well, I had a little bit of a mishap, misjudgment here. Um, even though I didn't put all of the ingredients inside there, it was still too much for this pan. So it was bubbling over on the sides, bubbling up in the middle. Uh, it's actually spilled on the bottom of my oven. So that's something I'm gonna have to clean up later. So, but anyway, uh, this, <laughs> is my pie. It is getting nice and golden brown on the edges here. So I'm going to let it cool down before I cut into it, but, but I'm looking forward to it. Well, here we go. I served it up with some uh, vegetarian brown gravy, which was a serving suggestion. So we've got uh, everything inside. The filling is nice and soft. The crust is crusty, <laughs> nice and browned. Uh, so I am looking forward to giving this a try, even though it is, as you can see, it's still pretty hot. <laughs> That's good. So there we go, Lord Wolton pie. Uh, a nice, tasty uh, vegetable pie. Um, very warming, um, very inexpensive ingredients, and um, yeah, it's uh, also a bit of a taste of history from World War II in times of shortage when they came up with some really creative solutions. So um, I'm posting all the links below, so if you'd like to make this yourself, then please check those out. As always, hit the thumbs up if you like this video. If you think someone else would like this video, then please share and also subscribe to my channel. Thanks. Bye.